So I'm walking down the beach alone looking for something to do and that's when I come across this little place called the Island of Make Belize because the play on words. And so I start going, hmm. I start going, I should look at this place. And as I walk in, this guy's like, you come in, you come in. What's your name? I'm Johnny. As soon as I stepped into it, I realized this was actually a bum who had taken a lot of garbage and put it in creative ways so that he could probably get money from tourists. All of a sudden I see this monkey in a cage and his name is Ponchero. Oh, cute little guy. Oh, ew, he's looking my ear. He's like, do you want to get in the cage with the monkey? And I'm like, yeah, okay, that sounds good. <laughs> so I get in the cage with the monkey, and he puts a lock on it. Really, I'm in this bum's house, and he has, and he has a monkey, and he let me in the cage, and he won't let me out. And then he's telling me I need to donate money. How did all of this stop? <laughs> Movie you got, wife. <laughs> so then even when I donate money and the lock is off, the monkey won't get off of me. Just keep saying, you just need to stay there until the monkey gets off. So I'm laying there for over an hour. <laughs> go ahead, go ahead, I'll let you down. He just won't go me. You're on a mission and you're wishing someone could cure your lonely condition. Looking for love in all the wrong places, no fire. And he's still on me and he won't get off. And then another guy comes into the cage and he tries getting the monkey off and the monkey bites him. Huge slash across his shoulder. Whoa! If you keep going, by, it's gonna be kind of $50 right, What? They, now there's more than one person. Okay, now there's more than one bum. This is a bum sanctuary. <laughs> this is a bum sanctuary. I've got a little cracker from Conchito. Ah, Panchito. Ah, Panchito. Going crazy, he wants that milk. Ah, Panchito there. Go get it. Go get it. It still doesn't want to get off of me. You got his cracker. It's still in the cage. Have a little bit of cracker. <laughs> then they take the hose on the monkey, and they, they try to hose they? him without hosing me. Now the monkey's going psycho. I'm dying over here. So they're just spraying me down with the hose, and the monkey's on top of me, clawing my neck. So bum number four comes in with weed. And he's like, come here, Ponchero. Come here, come here, get some weed, Ponchero. And Ponchero was like, I don't do drugs. Ponchero doesn't do weed. Just say no, Ponchero. Just say no to drugs. And there was one guy who was up at a window and he was just laughing the whole entire time, just getting a kick out of it. And the whole time I'm thinking, hey, why don't you try to help? I could be here a while. He bit the other guy. Still want my head to touch the ground. I'm never gonna get out of here. I'm still not taking a shower after this. Break it down for me, fellas. Can I get off now, little guy? You ready to get off? No, no, you're not. So the last day before the trip, I was actually gonna ask her out, and uh, and she left before I can get a chance to do us. Yeah, I used to play Sega Genesis a little bit in Nintendo. Yeah, the Red Sox won the World Series. I didn't know if you knew that or not. And I pulled the sword out of the stone. For sure, I came to try to find proof of the Book of Mormon, and I haven't exactly done that, but I've been able to apply it in a lot of ways, you know? Yeah. Yeah, that's her armpit. Laying down on the ground, and the monkey still hasn't gotten off. My best friend Harry has a brother Larry. In five days from now, he's gonna marry. I can't stand this! An hour goes by, finally this woman comes over and she's like, Come here, Ponchetto, come here. Instantly, the monkey gets up and goes over to the lady. There he is, there he is. There he is. I'm free, I'm free. Here's all the neighbors, they came over to help. Oh. Oh, poor little guy. He's like, hey, why don't you come up and talk to me? So I go up and talk to him, and it happens to be this guy who, I guess he got in a knife fight, and he lost, and he can't, he can't walk now. And so that's why he was just in the window the whole time. Hey, I'm Kurt. Kurt, I'm Johnny, good to meet you. Wow, did you do these? I did that with my right hand. Before I got stabbed, I made that one with, with this hand. He used to paint with his right hand, now he has to paint with his left, because, because his right hand got all slashed up by knives and stuff. And so I'm talking to him a little bit, and he's like, hey, do you want to buy my paintings? So there's a happy ending here after all. You want that money? Yeah. Except for the monkey. Uh, he says I own $200. Yes. That's like at least US. That's to a US. Lot. At least US. That's a boy. lot. What do you guys think of his story? <coughs> Johnny's on of... crack. Dude, it's all true. <laughs> I think there's no way it couldn't be true if you think about it. 
Johnny's told stories before. You can't make up stories like that. That's the tr that you can't make up stories like that. I wish somebody was there to verify it though.